Most of the content that I create is, can be used any time, any year. Uh, the principles are always the same, but today as we record, uh, something very unique is happening in our country, and that is uh, there is a war going on between Russia and the Ukraine, and uh, because of decisions our government has made, it is impacting our country dramatically, especially in the area of gas and fuel costs. If you've been to the, um, the gas go to fill up your car, it is now all $4 a gallon. We saw something today where it's $7 a gallon. And that has a huge impact on employers like yourself. You know, we have been given the opportunity to look at a company that does trucking. They're short haul, not long haul, but nonetheless, can you imagine being that employer and trying to figure out how you're going to handle the doubling of costs of your fuel? I mean, what do you do? Do you let people go? Uh, do you say you can't take on more business? What does an employer do to, uh, to take, you know, to prepare to be able to operate in uncertain times? And these aren't the only uncertain times. Of course, back in 2008, we had employers who weathered the, um, the, the Great Recession, as they called it, uh, they didn't have to lay people off. They, didn't have, they may have cut back on hours, but they kept the same people. They kept the same benefit plan because we had a strategy that helped them. We weren't reacting. We were always being very proactive in how we helped that employer. We've got an opportunity to talk with a trucking company that has 125 employees driving trucks all over the Midwest United States. Diesel fuel, of course, has just exploded, and uh, they're looking for a solution. They're fully insured, fully insured, fixed costs, no changes, and it's going to go up next year. So we're coming in with some ideas on self-funding, how to control those costs, get our drivers putting mobile apps on their phone so they're not just reacting, going to urgent care, buying prescriptions, wherever. We're helping to educate and direct those employees because an educated employee helps bring down the cost of healthcare. And ultimately that impacts that employer, it impacts you because the greatest part of your health insurance costs is claims. We use the 80-20 rule, 20% is fixed costs, brick and mortar, and all that kind of stuff, but 80% is claims. If we can control that 80% or begin to reduce it, we control costs and we can help employers just like yourself get through these really, really tough times when gasoline prices are going up, Inflation is the highest it's been forever. Uh, and these are having direct impacts on your business. And you might be saying, you know, my income is being affected. I, you know, all of these things. And that stupid health insurance premium is just gobbling up my bottom line. We don't want that to happen to you. We can help. So if you got any questions, you want us to come in and kind of give you a second opinion, give you some ideas, some strategies, whatever we can do to help you get through these uncertain times, we want to help you. We want to help you keep that hard-earned revenue. We want to help you improve your bottom line. We want to help you grow your business. And most of all, we want to help you offer great benefits to your employees so that you can have an incredibly stable business in incredibly unstable times. Thanks.